Good morning, Gino. Good morning, teacher. How are you? I'm very well. How about yourself? I'm fine, thank you. So today, Gino, we're going to talk about the advantages and disadvantages of traveling by private vehicle and public transport. Ashley would like to hear about your point of view or your perspective on using private vehicles or public transport. All right? Got it? I got the teacher. Okay. Go ahead, bro. This is a very interesting topic. I would like to discuss with you. As well. As well. Good. It is indeed. Gino, can you please tell everybody which you prefer to travel by? Private vehicle or public transport? I prefer public transport. Mm. I see. Mm. Mm. So, before you talk about traveling by private, uh, public transport, can you please share with the group some disadvantages of traveling by private vehicle? Yes, of course, teacher. The reason why I don't like private vehicles because firstly, an increase in use of private vehicles can cause traffic congestion. Unless the unless unless the before the infrastructure infrastructure mm -hmm. in develop or improved 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 second an increase in the use of private vehicles means an increase in the combustion of Fuels, fossil fuels, fossil fuels, an increase in carbon dioxide in our air, and therefore a negative effect on the environment. 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 Good. That's our teacher. Thank you for sharing those points with the class. So now we're going to move back to public transport. Can you please share with everyone why you prefer this mode of transport? Okay, teacher, I will give you some example why. Examples. Examples. Why I like public transport. Public transport. Public transport. Very good. Firstly, talking public transport can help reduce the carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide in the air used to be in less privately owned vehicles on the road. Secondly, Public transport provides job opportunities for drivers, ticket officers, security officers, and cleaning staff. And cleaning staff. And cleaning staff. Last but not least, taking public transport can help reduce traffic congestion because there are less vehicles on the road at any given time. Given time, right? Given time. Good. Yes. That is all. Thank you, Gina, for sharing that with the class and giving an insight into private vehicles and public transport. You're welcome, teacher. Okay, good job.